we begin your news at 6 in Pitt County with preparations to vaccinate up to 4,000 people a week for the coronavirus. It's all part of an effort by the county and Vidant Health to make more shots available. Nine on your side's Madison Forsey is live in the newsroom. And Madison, what are health leaders saying about the impact of this plan? Ken, Angie, they tell me that it's the ball game. They are preparing for an effective, widely distributed vaccine available less than a year after the pandemic started. It's a major moment, but starting out, it's also a waiting game. We have a fire hose, but it's going to be a trickle at first. A large scale vaccine rollout in Pitt County with a problem just as it gets in motion. This trickle um, just needs to be understood. Um, that that's the reality that all communities are facing and that we need patience and understanding. Patience and understanding that supplies of COVID vaccine are not meeting demand. We have a long way to go. We will be vaccinating for multiple months. Biden Health and Pitt County leaders will open a mass vaccination site at Greenville Convention Center on January 25th. Hundreds, even thousands of people would get the shot every day. We feel very confident that we can vaccinate 4,000 people next week. That's our plan, um, and I'm highly confident we will meet our plan. But the plan depends on the state supplying more vaccine. Workers are scheduling appointments with 8,000 people already on waiting lists. We know that, uh, you know, even if we had a dose for everybody, there'd still be a process to distribute it. Leaders say it's a step in the right direction. And how we come together and serve our communities dictates how our communities go through this historic time. More notes about this vaccination site. You don't have to live in Pitt County to get a shot at the convention center, but an appointment is required before you get the shot in the arm. We have information on how to get the vaccination, how to get on the wait list for the vaccination at WNCT.com. In the newsroom, Madison Forsey, 9 on your side.